Our tale begins in the year 77 BC, with the bloody Salon Civil War. General Sulla, having marched on Rome two years prior, found himself facing a rebellion led by the charismatic Marcus Aemilius Lepidus. Despite his fervor, Lepidus's uprising was short-lived. Sulla's forces crushed the rebellion, cementing his position as Rome's dictator. But the seeds of discord had been sown. The next few decades saw a series of tumultuous events that shook the very foundations of the Republic. A key figure emerged during this time, Gaius Julius Caesar. The year 59 BC marked Julius Caesar's consulship, a political high point marred by controversy and scandal. His audacious land reforms and alliances with powerful figures like Crassus and Pompey stirred a political hornet's nest. Fast forward to 50 BC, and Caesar found himself in Gaul, conducting a series of military campaigns that would secure his place in history. His victories over the Gauls not only expanded Rome's territories, but also bolstered his popularity among the Roman populace. Yet Rome was a city on the edge. The political tension between Caesar and the Senate reached a boiling point in 49 BC. Caesar crossed the Rubicon River, a direct challenge to the Senate and his former ally, Pompey. This marked the beginning of a civil war that would change Rome forever. The next four years were a whirlwind of battles and political maneuvering. Caesar emerged victorious, but at a great cost. The Republic was in shambles, its political structure fractured beyond repair. In 44 BC, Caesar, now declared dictator Perpetuo, met a tragic end. His assassination marked the end of the Roman Republic and paved the way for the rise of the Roman Empire. To recap, the fall of the Roman Republic was a complex cascade of events. Starting with the sullen civil war in 77 BC, it spiraled into decades of political unrest and military campaigns. Key events like Julius Caesar's consulship, the Gallic Wars, and the crossing of the Rubicon were instrumental in this downfall. Caesar's ascension to power and subsequent assassination in 44 BC sealed the fate of the Republic. Thus, the story of the Roman Republic's fall teaches us that even the mightiest can crumble under the weight of internal strife and political ambition. It is a timeless reminder of the delicate balance between power, ambition, and the survival of a civilization.